This is code.org. I'm currently working on CS Discoveries, their physical computing unit, and I'm on the lesson making music. Panio... <laughs> Piano Panic. So far you've just been using the elements of an array. Now you're going to change what's inside the array. And remember, an array is a list. That's all they're talking about. Our good friend the piano is back, except now it plays notes from two arrays, two lists, which hold natural notes, C, D, E, F, G, A, B, and sharp notes, which hold C sharp, D sharp, F sharp, G sharp, A sharp. Do this. The sharp notes array has array only has one item inside of it right now. Fix the array so that the sharp note keys on the piano can actually play the right note. Ah. And so right here is that sharp notes array, and remember it's a list. So to add, if you're in block mode, you can just click here, or you could just put a comma. We want it in between these two square brackets, okay? So what comes after C sharp? Well, if I look over here, I'm going to need, and remember, quotes, D sharp, and we need a 4 after it, and then... Oh, or do we? Let's try it without. Um, and then what comes next is F sharp. And then we're going to add another one to our list, which is going to be G sharp. And make sure you have quotes around all of these. And then finally, A sharp. And then hopefully, the notes get played, right? So notes, sharp notes. Are they used? Oh, way down here. So play C sharp, sharp which is at sharp notes array, and then index zero. Because remember, in index zero is the first one. This is one, two, three. Let's give it a shot. <laughs> awesome. Cool. Um, great, let's keep going.